Hey guys, this is Dapson Ishmael and in today's tutorial, let's take a look at how to change the mode of my header as I keep scrolling. You realize that it started from transparent and as I kept scrolling, it actually took a solid color here. So when I scroll back, it goes back to transparent and as I keep scrolling, it changes. So let's take a look at how to do this in WYSIWYG Web Builder. So to be able to have this take effect, I first of all need to have um, either a layout grid or layer, but I'm, in my case, I'm going to use layout grid. And then let me go ahead to configure my grid. So I'm going to change the padding to the top to about 15, to the bottom is also going to be about 15. And then I'm going to change the position of this to, um, to header fixed. I want this to be fixed at the top to stick right in there. And then I'm going to come back here and then position something in it. So I'm going to maybe use the CSS menu here so that it, it actually has something in it as I keep previewing this in my browser. Now the next thing is for me to have a scrollable page. So let me come to the toolbox and then let me get text here, which is going to allow me to have some sort of um, scroll, um, a scrollable page. So let me populate this with um, about 10 paragraphs. So this is going to help in having a scrollable page. And then maybe let me just add a bit more to it. So it increases it the more. And then the next part is for me to add the animation or transition to this particular layout grid. So I'm going to double click on it and then I'm going to head to the animation section. Now I'll come to transitions and this is where I'm going to add the transition to this particular grid. So I'll click on add and then the trigger is going to be on scroll because I want this to take effect as I keep scrolling on the page. And then the offset is going to be zero. The anchor is going to be at the top. The timing, I'll leave this on linear. And then the property, of course, I want to change the background color. So I'll go ahead and then select the color here, which is going to be black. And then one important thing you need to do also is to change the alpha value here to zero. The reason why I'm changing this to zero is I want to have it start from a very transparent background. And as I keep scrolling, it comes to the full black. So that is the first part. And then the second part is to add the same transition. Again, um, it's going to be on screw. This time around, I'm going to change the offset to something different. So maybe negative 500 or 600, maybe negative 600 is fine. And then anchor is going to be at the top. And then the timing is, um, I'll leave this as it is. Of course, I still want to change background color. And then this time around, I'm going to um, select the black, but I'm going to leave the alpha value as it is. So that is all I need to do. Click on OK, click on OK, and then preview this in the browser. So you realize that it's having a transparent background. And as I keep scrolling, it's taking the actual color that I want to have it. And when I scroll back, it does the same thing. As I scroll, it does the same thing. So that is just about it on how to go about setting um, this kind of transition to your layers or to your layout grid object in WYSIWYG Web Builder. So aside setting this to your layout grid, you can also do the same with layers. So let's take a look at how to go about it using layers. So let me come back to my toolbox. This time around, I'm going to look for layers or layer. Let me draw in here and make sure I expand this to fit the entire width of my page. Let me move my CSS, um, that is CSS menu to my layer here and then maybe come to the animations and see if I can copy the animations in here. So I'll copy it and then close this over here. I don't, I'm not sure I can paste it. So let me just get rid of my grid and then I'm going to change the mode of my layer. So this is going to be center. That's the alignment. And I'll change the mode to docking. So I want this to be at the top. So let me select docking layer and then dock to the top. I'll go ahead and then click on OK, move this to the top and then I'll click on it, come to the animation section and um, there's no paste functionality here. So let me just go ahead and then add. Um, so this is going to be on scroll. This is going to be at the top. This is going to be black. The alpha value is going to be zero. So let me change this to zero. Click on OK. Click on OK. The same transition again. This is going to be on scroll. This time around negative 600. This is going to be on top and this is going to be on black and then i'll click on ok click on ok now let me preview this in the browser and then as you can see once i keep scrolling the animation is set to that particular layer so basically that's how to go about adding this sort of transition to your layers and layout grid in WYSIWYG web builder 